It's a new day because Harvey Weinstein has finally been held accountable for crimes he committed. The women who came forward courageously and at great risk made that happen. Weinstein is a vicious, serial sexual predator who used his power to threaten, rape, assault, trick, humiliate, and silence his victims. He has been found guilty of criminal sexual act in the first degree and will face on that count a state prison sentence of no less than five years and up to 25 years. Dawn Dunning, Miriam Haley, Jessica Mann, Annabella Shora, Tarale Wolf, Lauren Young, Megan Hast, Joan Eluzi Orbon. Eight women who have changed the course of history in the fight against sexual violence. These are eight women who pulled our justice system into the 21st century by declaring that rape is rape and sexual assault is sexual assault no matter what. Rape is rape, whether it's committed by a stranger in a dark alley or by an intimate partner in a working relationship. It's rape, whether it's committed by an indigent person or a man of immense power, prestige, and privilege. Rape is rape whether the survivor reports within an hour, within a year, or perhaps never. It's rape despite the complicated dynamics of power and consent after an assault. It's rape even if there is no physical evidence and even if it happened a long time ago. This is the new landscape for survivors of sexual assault in America, I believe, and this is a new day. Harvey Weinstein will now have to finally face the serious consequences of his criminal behavior at his sentencing here in New York on March 11th. The most serious charge is the one that he was convicted on from my client Mimi. For that, he can face 10 to 25 years. And the victim does have an opportunity to speak at the sentencing and give her victim impact statement. And uh, in the event that Mimi is available on March 11th, she and I will be here in order to do that. Donna